Helping you and your children live healthy back to school this year means more screen time for most kids with a greater reliance on remote learning because of COVID-19, meaning they're on their computers, they're on their tablets, they're on their smartphones. As a result, people now spend an average of 13 or more hours each day on digital devices, potentially leading to eye health issues because of excessive exposure to blue light. So joining us this morning to discuss ways to reduce damaging exposure to blue light, Chief Eye Care Officer for United Healthcare, Dr. Scott Edmonds. Good morning to you. Good morning. All right. So look, we are literally glued to our electronic devices. It's very hard uh, to live a modern life without those kids nowadays too. And especially this year, because so many of them are not going to be in that traditional classroom setting. That's for sure. And, and so there's a couple things we can do to reduce the risk of digital eye strain. So digital eye strain comes from overexposure to digital devices like cell phones and uh, laptops and iPads and even television. Um, so some of these tips would include pushing the kids or any user at least 30 inches away from the device. Kids in particular like to choke up on their screens. We should make sure they're always 30 inches. Uh, they should rest their eyes every 20 minutes and they should blink, uh, blink their eyes frequently to avoid their eyes becoming dried out uh, during digital work. All right. So I've heard about the 20-20-20 rule. Can you go into that a little bit more? I know that you're kind of talking about that. Yes, so when we talk about resting every 20 minutes, we have an easy way to remember that and make it most useful. And so first that would be every 20 minutes, you should focus your eyes at an object 20 feet or further, like out a window, and then you should do that for 20 seconds. So every uh, 20 minutes, a 20 second break looking at an object uh, 20 feet or beyond. And there are now some glasses and things that we can use to, uh, to put on that'll hopefully help us get rid of that, or not get rid of it, but minimize the blue light exposure. Can you tell me about those? Do they actually work or is it just a ploy? Sure, no, there's uh, so blue light is the culprit in, in digital devices. Our, you know, we're used to exposure to blue light, but there's been new evidence that like ultraviolet light, visible blue light can cause damage to the tissues of the body when it's uh, used excessively. So these screens, as we said earlier, you know, kids 13 hours and we expect it to go up now with the back to school that's gonna be digital. Uh, we want to have protection. So we uh, go into the eye doctor to get the uh, per correct focus and then getting filters or, or uh, coatings on the lenses that either reflect back the blue light or absorb the blue light uh, can protect the eyes. Uh, so those filters do work. And a third uh, option is to get devices and there's uh, software you can use on your device that cuts the blue light from your phone. Sometimes it's called the night mode on your computer or on your phone. And these also reduce the blue light exposure from digital devices. But at the end of the day, if you're starting to see problems with your kids, if you think that their vision is changing, that's when you need to see an expert. That's, that's correct. So the things the parents should look for are the kids that are squinting or blinking when they're, and they're, when they're watching television, or you notice that they always want to sit right on top of the television rather than at a comfortable distance. They may have trouble catching a ball or when they have exposure to 3D games or 3D activity, they either get dizzy or struggle with uh, 3D activities. Those are all tips that the child needs uh, an eye examination and that we would recommend that to rule out problems. Very important information. Great talking with you this morning, Dr. Scott Edmonds with United Healthcare. We appreciate your time. Great. Thanks for having me.